right, boys and girls, this is our um, English for this for um, uh, Monday, and we are going to be talking about um, emotions and traits in characters and stories. So they're going to give you an example and of either a trait or an emotion, and they want you to find the sentence that tells that that shows that emotion a little bit better than the other. So let's look at IXL. We're going to IXL V1, okay? Okay, you are writing a story about Kurt, who sees a high wire act at the circus. Choose the best description to show that Kurt is amazed. Kurt looked at the person sitting next to him and smirked, give me a break, he said. Kurt leaned forward in his seat, wide-eyed, and silently mouthed the word, wow. To me, this second sentence shows that Kurt is amazed. The other one kind of shows like, really, I don't believe he can do that. You are writing a story about Mora, who is a new student. Choose the best description to show Mora is shy. Mora glanced at the clock. How was it? Not even noon yet. Sighing, she rested her head on the desk. Mora buried her hands in her pockets and fixed her eyes on the floor. To me, this one shows that she's like bored. She's really can't believe how slow time is going. This one shows me more that she's um, shy. Because if you're shy, you're not going to look at somebody. You are writing a story about Tori who is running in a race. Choose the best description to show Tori is tough and determined. Tori breathed in the spring air as she took long, even strides down the track. Tori's chest burned from breathing so hard, but she ran on toward the finish line. This one doesn't really show that she's um, determined or tough. This one, uh, her chest is burning from breathing so hard, but she's not giving up. She's determined. Okay. Um, you're writing about Brenna, who is in math class. Uh, choose the best description that shows Brenna is smart. If she closed her eyes, Brenna thought, maybe the teacher wouldn't call on her. Brenna's hand shot in the air. She was the only student who knew the answer. That would show me that she's smart when she wants to answer questions, okay? This is the last one I'm going to do with you. You are writing a story about Carrie who entered a drawing contest. Choose the best description to show Carrie is proud. Carrie stood in front of her drawing as if to hide. Carrie stood next to her finished drawing and smiled. Her head held or her head high. If you're proud, you're not trying to hide. You're going to be um, standing and smiling and holding your head up. So that's how you do this. You're going to go to um, IXL Language Arts V1. Show character emotions and traits. Okay, have an awesome day.